Okay guys, uh, this is Eric Daniels, aka Eric the Killhound. And uh, lately I've been getting a lot of comments on my Airsoft vs. Paintball vids that have been saying I don't know crap about Airsoft and I talk too much about Paintball, you know. Well honestly, I started in Airsoft, okay. Almost, almost six years ago now. Okay, and uh, I know things. Um, first gun I ever bought was a FN model, uh, electric, um, you know, and I didn't really know what airsoft was at the time, so I just bought something I thought would work, something, you know, that would get me somewhat into the sport, or I thought it would, you know, and uh, since that day I've bought tons of stuff okay um now when I was leaving in Arkansas okay um I bought tons of stuff uh I had all kinds of different AK-47 models and M16s and all just about every H and K you could get uh I had different shotguns um sniper rifles which is you see I'm kind of working on one right now it's in pieces um it's a swiss arms uh, i'm really wishing it was working um because th this gun served me so well that it i'm just in, i'm just i'm really mad that it stopped working okay and especially since i can't even figure out what's wrong with it um everything here looks like it's in working order and you know I, I can't figure out what's wrong with it. Um, now, you know, I, I've talked about a lot of topics in my airsoft versus paintball vids. Um, you know, people are saying I don't know anything. Uh, the reason airsoft guns shoot faster is because they got springs and gearboxes and stuff like that. Well, yes, that's true. An airsoft gun is most of the time, if you're buying good guns, it's gonna shoot faster than a paintball gun. Um, however, okay, because you're working with springs, you're working with electronics, you're working with gears, it's going to wear down after time. I don't care how well you take care of it. I, I don't. I don't care how well you take care of it. Um, your springs, your gears, everything's going to wear down after time. Even metal, okay, it's, it's going to wear down. Uh, you may originally be shooting, if you take really good care of a, say you buy a sniper rifle okay like my swiss arms that i had and i took extremely good care of this thing I had a really really smooth bolt you know i was never extremely if i started getting into a heavy firefight i would either pull out my pistol grip shotgun or my co2 pistol i was not about to risk you know pulling the bolt off because i was trying to slam fire because i was trying you know jack the bolt really fast you know i, I was not about to you know do that um this thing served me for roughly two years okay and then stopped working completely okay i've pulled it apart tried to figure out what's going on and i there's no explanation for it only thing i can figure out is the spring uh to hold the pressure hold the spring pressure for when you would cock it which you can see you can hear it okay and it won't stay back usually it would stay back but now it slips okay so i don't know what's going on there uh trigger won't even function after you do that so i don't know but i have the first okay i upgraded what was that sniper rifle into a paintball marker with the first paintball marker i ever bought okay it's been nearly five years since I started playing paintball. Closer to six. Because I started only a couple months after I played airsoft for the first time. Because when it hit fall, for some reason we switched over to paintball for the mainstream. And we would play night games and stuff like that for airsoft and smaller games. Okay. Like I said, this is the first marker I ever bought. And I have run some serious, serious... Uh, 
measures through this gun, okay? This marker. Um, you know, I, I haven't been easy on it, okay? But, still in working condition. It, it's been twice as long, almost three times as long as, as this sniper rifle worked. Okay. Airsoft versus paintball. I, the comments have said, you know, I didn't mention that airsoft guns shoot faster because of their gears and springs and stuff uh, I said they shot faster I didn't feel like I had to go into detail okay everybody knows you're buying good airsoft guns they're usually shooting over 300 feet per second even spring are usually shooting over 300 feet per second if you're buying good stuff okay so I didn't feel like going into detail but I will now okay so, when I originally bought the sniper rifle, we chronoed it. It was doing like 430, okay, with 20 grain. Um, and I stuck with 20 grain because it was doing a good, accurate shot. I scoped it at 100 yards and was hitting a quarter size target 9 out of 10 times. So, <laughs> I didn't feel like switching to 28 or 25, you know, or even 3s. Uh, you know, I don't need it. Um, But the thing I have to say about springs and gears and stuff, like I already said, they're gonna wear down. A paintball gun, a paintball marker, is using CO2 or high pressure air. CO2 is a dirty gas, so you're using high pressure air, you're gonna get more lifetime out of it. But the guy, the editor of APG, still has one of the, I believe it's one of the original Tipmans. He's had it for like 20 years, and he still uses it as a backup gun, okay? It, it, it's 20 years old okay um, I bought a stingray at a pawn shop uh, I, I don't know how many of you are gonna realize what a stingray is but it, it's it's old okay it's, it's a semi-auto but it is one of the old ones okay it comes with like a four and a half inch stock barrel but it still works okay and I've seen that that gun's been that marker's been put through Hell. Okay. Um, and it's made to run off of CO2, not HPA, so it's also using the dirty gas, and it's still in working condition. Okay. So, yes, airsoft guns shoot faster. I don't know how many times I've said that. I've said that in pretty much every video I've made for airsoft or paintball. Okay. But um, who cares? Airsoft is fun. Paintball is fun. Um, airsoft gets a on my part airsoft gets a lower rating but you know why that is I live in the middle of Minnesota okay the only guys I can play airsoft with are really some friends that I have and we just get together and go out and shoot okay I can go to Fargo I can go to a big field and just over the border uh, right past Minneapolis uh, splat tag um, I can go to paintball fields all over the state and play actual tournaments, play scenarios, play big games, okay? So, I, I know, you know, Airsoft has its advantages, whatever, if you're looking for Milsom, but I talked about that. If you want to, if, I'm just really sick of guys calling me out because the, I'm 17, okay, I've done my research, I'm sick and tired of this, um, you want to talk to me, send me a video response, don't be a punk and send me comments, especially, uh, I don't even remember the guy's name now, but you don't even have any videos uploaded or crap, and you're saying, I don't know anything about airsoft, shut the hell up, go away, just, stop trolling, okay, go, go away, you, you have no business, saying I don't know crap about yourself um, and I talk too much about paintball you, you know what send me a video response don't be a punk okay let me see your face and if you live anywhere near Minnesota let's go okay I'll play you one-on-one -on -one. whatever one-on-five bring your other guys don't care 